I woke up with the sun today, rolled out of bed and said, I'm gonna have some fun today, and that's just what I did. The birds were singing, come outside, I felt giddy like a kid. If life is like a swimming pool, you know I'm jumping in. We got the perfect summer day, so put me in your plans. You know that this doesn't happen every day, so everybody clap your hands. Cause when we raise them high, every hand in the sky, we're the super fans. Feeling grand in the clear stands, shout it out, make some noise, make it loud, soaking up. Wow, what an amazing intro. These are my first impressions on everybody's golf for the PlayStation 4. After being introduced to the chairman and a brief explanation of the world, you're allowed to create your character and jump right into the action. And by jumping right into the action, I mean you're literally thrown into the deep end. You immediately start competing in beginner's tournaments and can't help but feel intimidated as you watch the AI tee off. A brief explanation on how the aim and swing your club pops up, but it still took me a few seconds to comprehend before I was able to tee off myself. As you can see, I didn't do too well. And I continue to mess up my shot. And mess up some more. Oh no! And mess up some more. Down Finally, here? I was able to land my first sinker. Which still resulted in a bogey. No. Judging by my character's expression, that's not a good thing. But eventually, I got the hang of it, and I started to get a little bit better. I was starting to make par and not get bogeys anymore. Three victory dance. Soon, I was beginning to make pretty decent shots. And trust me, when I say the learning curve on this game is steep, I'm not kidding. To swing the ball correctly, you have to press X on the left side of the bar to adjust power, and X once more on the right side for accuracy. Cool. Look at but I don't always hit it correctly. Sometimes, I get stuck in a bunker. You have to take into account wind speed and cool. direction in order to send the ball going exactly where you want it to land. The more you play, the more your golfer levels up, and the specific club that you already. choose to use, which is perfect because it gives this game more incentive to play more and better your skills. After winning a couple tournaments, I was challenged to a one-on-one -on -one match with another skilled competitor. These matches can get pretty tense, which adds an extra layer of competition and skill to the game, resulting in an overall better gameplay experience. So far, I am loving this game, and I can't wait to jump back in to deepen my skills and have more fun golfing. Thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed my first impressions video on Everybody's Golf.